All right, we're at the Microsoft Store in the Mall of America, and we're doing a quick little zombie PC event, just wrapping up, and we're gonna take a quick little video walkthrough <coughs> of the newest Microsoft Surface and Windows 8 platform for it. So with that, if you wanna introduce, introduce yourself and walk us through the platform. Hey guys, I'm Dee Dee. All right, so check this out. This is the new Microsoft Surface tablet. This is running Windows 8 RT right now. First of all, I'd like to show you the hardware. I'm going to speak up just a little bit. Check this out. All the clicking, all that fun stuff that you see in the video and the commercial, does it as well. Magnetic strip right down here. And then right back here, there's a little bezel to activate the kickstand. You just flip that open, and it sits nicely just like that. Or you can also flip this over. It actually deactivates the keyboard, and it'll sit nicely on your lap, which is super nice. Now, check this out. The strip is also strong enough to support the weight of the device, which is at 1.5 pounds. Also, the screen itself is scratch resistant and shatterproof. Yeah, just a little bit of glare, so let's just tip it in a sure. There we go. Absolutely. The screen here is made out of Gorilla Glass 2. All right. Which is the, uh, it's basically the toughest glass out on the market right now. So if you drop it, whatever, it should be perfectly fine. Now, the, um, let's talk about the casing behind here. This is out of, made out of uh, vapor magnesium, which is the same type of stuff that they make planes in the army with. So it's vapor magnesium? Vapor magnesium, yep. Is that like what the Iron Man suit's made of? Or? <laughs> Next. All right, so um, so it's extremely durable, but it also makes it super super light as well. All right, now let's uh, let's talk about the, uh, the operating system. Good old software. Yep. Whoop. Let's uh, put this over here. Hold on one second. There we go. All right, so the Surface tablet is running a full version of Windows 8 RT. Basically, you've got a full blown operating system in a tablet. Um, so check this out. A quick overview of Windows 8. If you don't know how to use it at all, if you've never seen it before, the way to use it is going to be the sides. So top, bottom, left, right. The, uh, the right side here, if you swipe in from the right, will always have your settings. And your start button will always take you right back to your home screen. Otherwise, this little guy here is uh, touch capacitive as well. It'll take you right back to your home screen. Um, let's open up a few apps. Let's open up this guy. And swipe in from the right. Hit start, take you right back over here. Let's open up our mail. Alright, so notice how with Windows 8, it utilizes your full screen. It's always a full screen experience. How do you close an app? It's really simple. Top to bottom, closes down the app. Let's open that up one more time. So now what if I want to get back to my Internet Explorer, which is running in the background? Really simple. That's where you, you, you uh, utilize the left side, right over here. You can actually swipe in from the left and flip through apps just like that, or you can also see a full list of them as well. That's about it. Windows nice. And, and as we talked about, um, classic Word apps and Office ah. apps, can you show us that real quick? Check this out. So the uh, Windows 8 RT tablet, um, the Surface tablet, comes with a preview of Office 2013. So, check this out. It'll actually run on a more familiar desktop setting. Okay. Which is you just saw there. From here, you can edit PowerPoint presentations on the fly. You can create them, stuff like that. You have full functioning Office onto okay. this tablet. No other tablet in the market can do that right now. So tell us about the more classic uh, desktop ah. that, that you see there. Sure. Um, users can both swipe into this as well as when they launch Office mm -hmm. apps. It brings you natively into this for Word, Excel, etc. Yep. And, and what what can you do in that in that traditional desktop? Ah, uh, so with the RT version, it is limited because it's running on an ARM processor. Yep. If you wanted to run older apps such as Quicken and stuff like that, um, you're going to want to wait for the Pro tablet, which is, um, that one's going to have an Intel processor, so that one will literally be a full-blown laptop, basically. Okay. Yep. So we can launch and launch Excel spreadsheets on here and everything? Oh yeah, absolutely. Okay. Yep, yep. Go this is... let's, see how, let's see how that looks. Ah, here, let's go back from the... Uh... Show me Excel real quick. Sure. And then show me Word. Absolutely. From here, we can tap blank workbook. Here we go. So, pinch, pinch and, uh, to zoom and, and zoom in, zoom out. Mm -hmm. Touch gesture. You can also select all these slides, as stuff well like that. As well as the, uh, the trackpad mm -hmm. usability. 
within here as well, which is really key. Mm -hmm. Our spreadsheets. Yep. All right, let's see Word real quick. Yeah. Now, you did that off a native uh, taskbar button down there versus the other way. Yep, it is quicker. I mean, yep. yep. So let's pull up a little document. Oh, sure. Okay. Oh, blank. Check this out. So up here, we've got all your nice basic functions, stuff like that. Excellent. So we're actually seeing a lot of what you see out of Classic Office 2010 right now in terms of uh, the layout tabs. And, uh, and that comes uh, for initial cost on the tablet? Or does that come free? Office, you mean? Yeah, the office, this is version of Office. Is that ah, comes part so of the right name? now, this is a preview of Office 2013, which is your four basic apps right now. Um, Word, PowerPoint, Excel, and OneNote. When it is released in a couple months from now, it will be a free upgrade. Excellent. For the RT. Anything else you would add to this? Um, can I print? Yes, you can. You can print wirelessly, or there's also a USB port right back here. This right here is a it's mini sure. H. Okay, there oh, we go. Yep, there we go. It's a USB 2.0 port, so you can definitely uh, connect flash drives, you know, printers, stuff like that. Okay. Um, this little guy right here is a mini HDMI or VGA as well, and right behind the kickstand. We have a micro SD slot, so memory is expandable up to 64 gigs on this guy. Excellent. Anything else you'd uh, consider sharing? Or is that a pretty good wrap? Um, that's about it, man. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks. I appreciate the uh, the heads up on the new platform, the new Microsoft Surface. We're at the Microsoft Store talking about zombie PCs and moving on. Thanks.